Hello, welcome to Ludic Science. In this video, I will show you how to make the simplest lithium ion battery charger. As you can see, you only need three components, a MOSFET transistor, potentiometer, and a resistor. With this charger, you can charge your lithium ion batteries, such as these ones. And as you may know, these batteries are becoming more popular each day because of their characteristics. They have a very large capacity, low weight, and they can produce large currents, which makes them ideal for high power applications. Here is the schematic, very simple as you can see. Resistor 470 ohms, potentiometer 10 kilo ohms, and you can use any power MOSFET. I am using the IRF 1407. And at this point, you connect your battery, positive and negative terminal. The two resistances form a voltage divider, and by varying the potentiometer, we can control the voltage to the gate of the MOSFET, thereby changing the voltage at the battery's terminals. Next time you need a PCB for your electronics project, consider using the professional services of JLC PCB. JLC PCB is the world leader in PCB fabrication. You can order online. You just need to register, upload your Gerber file, and wait a few days for your PCBs at an unbeatable price. In order to use the charger, we need to connect it to our power supply, 12 volts input, and connect your multimeter to the terminals where the battery goes. Turn on the power supply, and then adjust the potentiometer. You can see that by moving the potentiometer, we can vary the voltage, and you need to adjust the potentiometer until you get 4.1 volts at the output. Okay, 4.1 volts. Okay, this is the battery that I want to charge and our charger is the simplest charger in the world, but with simplicity, we have disadvantages, of course, and one of the disadvantages of this charger is that it is not current limited. Therefore, we need a power supply that can limit the current. You want to charge your battery at one half of the rated capacity. This one, for example, says that it has a capacity of 8800 milliamp hours, which of course is not true. This is a Chinese battery. And I made a video before where I test the real capacity of these batteries, the Chinese batteries, and it is closer to 800 milliamp hours that is 10% of what they are supposed to be. So we need to charge this battery at half of that, which is 400 milliamps. Therefore, we need to adjust our power supply to 400 milliamps. Right now it's at 500. Let's put it at 400 milliamps. And now we can connect our battery to the charger output. Okay, the battery is now charging. You can see that we have the maximum current from the power supply, 400 milliamps. This is because the battery is completely discharged and also the voltage is at 4 volts. The charging process ends when the current drops to a low value like 
40 or 50 milliamps and your voltage reaches 4.1 volts. Okay, that's all for today. Super simple lithium ion battery charger. I hope you liked this video. If that is the case, please visit my Patreon page. Thanks for coming to my channel and see you in the next video. Thank <laughs> you.